One day, Sankuryang went back to his village. He was big and strong. There, he met a beautiful young woman. He fell in love with her at the first sight. He did not know that she was the young Sumbi. She could never get older because she was granted eternal youth by the gods. One day, he approached Dayang Sumbi to propose her. Dayang Sumbi saw the bad scar on his forehead. She soon realized that he was her own son, Sang Kuria. She told him the truth again and again, but he would not believe her. She was thinking hard to find a way not to marry him. Then, she got an idea. She gave him a task which she thought was impossible for him to do. She asked him to make her a lake and a boat in one night. She did not know Sangkuryang had genius to help him to do the task. By dawn, both the lake and the boat were almost done. The young Sumbi got very worried. She was thanking her again to find a way to fail him. Then, she had an idea. She asked the people in the village to burn the woods in the east, so that the light made all the cocks in the village crow. The genius thought that the morning was almost broken. They ran away as fast as they could leaving the boat unfinished. Knowing Dayang Sumbi cheated him, Sang Kuryang got very angry. He kicked the boat so hard that it went upside down. It is now known as Mount Tangkuban Perahu. It is located 30 km in the north of Bandung, in the direction of Lembang. Located at the heartland just at the outskirts of Bandung, Tangkuban Perahu Crater is surely a perfect place to enjoy cool air and relaxing sceneries.